all been together for this for three and a half years. I know today is a sad day. I mean, I'm immeasurably sad. But we have to hold on to the fact we've been a part of this for 47 years. We contributed a lot, but we also gained a lot. Our society changed because of the influence of the EU, of all the member states, and we must never lose sight of that. And at one second past 11 tonight, I believe something called Rejoin campaign starts. Yeah! And we will rejoin. It may take a few years, it may take longer, but I, I have absolutely no doubt we will rejoin. Yeah. We, we owe it to the next generation to campaign for that. Absolutely. The young people don't realize, I think, just what they're about to lose. They're, all the freedoms, all the choices we've had for over 40 years, their lives are going to be diminished because of this. And we must do our best to try and rejoin as soon as possible. And we know it makes sense. Most of the country, is in, it, apparently if there was a referendum tomorrow, 53% would vote to remain. It's, it is changing. And um, if Boris Johnson can be proud of what we've just seen today, then... Um, Let's see what unfolds to come in the months yeah. ahead or the years ahead. I want to thank you all for coming. I also want to say, some, say something very special. Clive Lewis, who, has, who worked tirelessly to try and stop Brexit, and he campaigned since the day of the referendum. I met him on many occasions, sadly passed away yesterday. Oh. And, and I just want to pay respect to the work he did, to the fight he put up, and to his family around it, we, you know, we will never forget the work he did. So in memory of Clive Lewis. <laughs> you know, we may be small in number today, I don't care. You know, lots of news agency asked me in the last week, how many people are coming? I said, I don't know, I don't care if it's just me. It's not about size, it's not about quantity of numbers, it's just about who we are. It's about the fact that we wanted to show respect today, that we honoured the people we've actually been dealing with for the last four seven years. Nobody else seemed to in government want to do that. But actually, I'm grateful that we be part of this. And so grateful that I know we're going to be part of it again because we've got so much to, 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 to get from being part of this club. It's, it's crazy that we should actually separate and think we could go it alone. Okay, I'm not going to fight that. I accept it. The decision's been made. But it doesn't mean that I don't hope or I'm going to campaign to rejoin. We have rights to do that. This is democracy. That's what it means to be a democracy. And I know that, you know, I'm tired after three and a half years, but I'm not tired enough that I won't stop. And I will keep... stop either until we rejoin because I know how much it means to all of you. We all know why we're doing this. We all know why we care so much about this.